Senator Organa, Master Coda has sent me to rescue you. <sighs> I knew he couldn't stay out of the fight for long. But I thought he'd be angry with me for ignoring his advice. He's angry, but I think he wants to be able to yell at you in person. Hurry. Shakti's apprentice has gone mad. This whole planet has gone insane. Oh, we're not crazy. We've just embraced the power of the dark side. Stand aside, girl. Don't make me hurt you. <laughs> you won't. He won't let you. What? Oh, you're gonna fight dirty. Okay, okay. Oh, I see how that is. You want to fight dirty. Okay, so before we fight Maris Brew, the corrupt apprentice of Shock Master Shock T, we got a bull rancor to destroy. So, find him like any other rancor you would, but, well, kinda, but this guy is no slouch. He will not be stunned by your lightning attacks, and this guy is a pain in the butt. Now, now from time to time, Maris Brew will come out. We'll come out and uh, we'll, and uh, try to try to uh, get some damage in on you. Now you can't do any damage to her until you finish up this bull rancor, which is the pit Maris Brood was talking about. Let me see that little cutscene when we try to where the senator got captured. What we? Oh, shut! Stop you! Okay, yeah, yeah. You can do that, and then she'll disappear. Try to, just, the, my advice is just try to stay ahead of the bull rancor and watch out for his attacks. It might take some. That's the only type of damage you can actually do to the rancor. Lightning. I would not recommend doing your lightning attacks unless you're in the go in the good. Hey! No! 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 Where the frig am I? And I got destroyed. Okay, there we go. He's about down to half health. Yes, whenever you charge out, you'll be a good time to do your dash. Oh, hey, where'd you come from? Yes, that's what happens when you embrace the power of the dark side. You can do crazy crap like that. I mean, of course, that's... Nah, you know what I mean. Yes, ever since Shock T... Has, uh, ever since Shock T's defeat, uh, the entire plan of Felucia has now been run at Imperials, and the apprentice Maris Brood has uh, embraced the power of the dark side. Oh, yeah, she can do that. She can do that. Yeah, yo, 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 yo! I don't know why I said yo 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 yo. I'm not a rat. I'm not. I'm not a gangster. I don't know, but that's down to half health. Oh shut up! Yeah, she can do that, but just get one hit on on the Maris Brew before she disappears. Come on, you won't do any damage to her though. Oh, you no 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 Oh, yeah, 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 whoa! See, I'm telling you, Maris Brood, well, the corrupt Maris Brood is what it's known as, fights, fights dirty. Yes, um, you may be able to get a couple hits in on the, uh, on the, uh, on the Rancor, but, but whenever he gets ready to do his charge attack, just do a normal lightsaber throw, by the way. Man! Charge in your lightsaber throw whenever you attempt to attack. Attempt to attack them. And yes, um, sometimes the Rancor can actually accidentally hit Marish Brood. Yes, you got that in the case right there. I would recommend using your normal lightsaber throw when you get caught, when you get ready to charge. But whenever you're in a situation like this, uh, that's when you should charge up your lightsaber attack. Or lightsaber throw, is what I meant to say. Okay. Okay, see like that right there. See, I didn't, I didn't get enough time to get any throws in.
Okay, he's about done. He's about done. Now, as long as I don't die... And when you get out of here... Oh, you just cost me to waste my force energy. Okay, okay, here we go. This is what I wanted. Yeah, this can be a hard. Normally, it takes me several attempts to beat this guy, but luckily, I got it done on the first try. Uh oh. No. Throw him away. Lift him up. And do that. And down he goes. <laughs> bye bye. But we're not done yet. The second part of this boss battle has just now begun. Now we fight Maris Brood. And this this girl is no freaking slouch. She can do some serious damage if you're not careful. Yes, that right there. Remember her dual lot super throws? And she can disappear. So I was just this is a this boss battle you're gonna have to have a lot of patience at because yeah she can do that which is kind of annoying she'll disappear and does I'll do some damage right there ah. no you don't oh. okay right there I got some damage in oh we get some good damage in Oh sh Stop your laughing. You're not getting anywhere. Okay, there we go. Yes, force repose when she when, when No mercy my ass. Good lord. Yeah, when she's flashing green, I don't think you can attack her. Oh actually yes you can. Lucia is mine. Lucia! Oh, well, I, thought I, I thought I was able to stun her right there. Okay, apparently not. She's about dead. But well, I see her. Yes, yeah, so you can tell. You can tell where she is. I'm gonna pause it right here. You can tell where uh, Marish Brood is whenever she disappears by that little, uh, little uh, white line thing when she's floating in the air. Whoa! Nice acrobats. Ooh, there you. Whoa! Be careful. Watch the nads, man or woman. Aha! Ooh. Now that would have cut her legs off. It looked like it went for her legs, but it didn't cut them off. Okay, you've won. The senator's yours. There's no need to kill me now. You are a slave to the dark side. I'd be doing the galaxy a favor. It's not my fault. Shakti abandoned me here. This planet is evil. He corrupted me. You. You can save me. But just let me get away from here. I'll turn my back on the dark side. That one. She reminds me too much of another young Jedi who turned to the dark side. You shouldn't have let her go free. You really think she's free? She'll carry the memories of what she's done here forever. Yeah, uh, yes, ladies and gentlemen, that is uh, Imperial. Uh, Imperial Felucia, we have rescued Senator Bell Organa. So now he can actually help us with the Rebel Alliance. And we're trying to form. And corrupt Maris Brood, that's Shakti's apprentice. And yep, let's move on. Open rebellion is too dangerous, Master Koda. I know I owe you my life, but you don't owe me anything. I told you in Cloud City that I can't help you. And since I lost my sight. He's your hero, and it's his rebellion. Join us because he's asking you to. You are the first to really fight the Empire. We're not prepared to go to war yet. 
We need weapons and starships and people with the courage to use them. I don't know how many others will stand with us. But surely you know some who will. Well, yes, there are other senators who have spoken out against the Emperor. But they will be hard to convince. We just need to show them that the Empire is vulnerable. Let me meditate on that. I'm sure we can find the right target. In the meantime, Senator, gather your friends. We need all the help we can get. Master, he's here. You have received my message? Yes. Your mission goes well. I have recruited others to my cause, but now I need your counsel. My allies seek a major strike against the Empire. The Emperor rules the galaxy through fear. You must destroy a symbol of that fear. The Empire is building star destroyers above Raxus Prime. That shipyard is your next target. Thank you. Lord Vader. There is much conflict in you. Your feelings for your new allies are growing stronger. Do not forget that you still serve me. I hate being here. I think he does too. Master. Juno. I came to find out where you wanted to go next. But it looks like you've already been told. Juno, this isn't what it looks like. Of course it is. You're still loyal to Vader. After he branded me a traitor and tried to kill you, you're still his... his... Slave. Then why did you defy Vader to rescue me? I needed someone to fly the ship. We both know that's not true. My being here has never been about my pilot. Sometime soon, you will decide the fate of the Rebellion, not your master. And when you're faced with that moment, just remember that I too was forced to leave behind everything I've ever known. <coughs> Please, don't make me leave another life behind. Okay, guys, um, that's going to do it for this recording session. Um, that was Imperial Felucia. Join us next time on Let's Play Star Wars The Force Unleashed. We return to Rax's Prime, and we are going to... We are going to uh, uh, do some stuff here. I'm just trying to think of the objective. I'm just going to look at the objective if I can. Well, maybe I can. I'll, I'll look at it later. So basically, we just need to try to uh, destroy an Imperial target. To show the weakness of the Empire, I think is what uh, Bill O'Brien said. But anyhow, that's going to do it for this video, for this session, guys. This is Squad 16 signing out. Later.